subscribe. Also, hit the bell button so you don't miss any videos. Hello everyone, it's me Waco. Welcome back to my channel. You might be wondering why are we in another background? Uh, it's because I have a big haul to show you. I noticed that a lot of times when I'm doing the haul videos, it's just so hard to show you a, a blouse or a skirt. Uh, just by sitting on my chair, so I decided to move on this area so it's a lot easier for you to see So in today's video, I'm gonna be doing an unboxing of a Japanese fashion that not many people know because it's pretty pretty dead But there's faith. <laughs> so this fashion style is called uh, Mori Girl. I'm just gonna let you know that it's very different than what I usually uh, show you, like it's not pastel, it's not pink or anything like that even though I have few things that are pink but they were not part of this haul so why was I interested on buying this clothing? well it's because I've been wanting to dress up as a modi girl for years like since I was in high school I really like it because uh, I feel like a connection with that fashion if that makes sense I haven't dressed as a Mori girl, uh, like never. I know that I have few pieces and I know that I've been attracted to a lot of the things that you can see on the Mori girl fashion, but I never, I was never able to like make a whole outfit. So I just decided to, you know, I'm gonna finally do it now that I'm able to, you know, get all this stuff. And yeah, that's what are we gonna do on this video. I'm gonna let you know that the concept of this fashion is about layers, a lot of layers, natural colors, uh, laces, very natural. Mori girl means uh, a forest girl, a girl that looks like she came out of the forest. So that's the concept, it's more about forest, animals, nature. But without any more waiting, I'm going to start showing you two things that are literally no Mori. It's just that I ordered them like way before I decided to go like and purchase Mori stuff. So the first item is another pair of hangers. I actually bought five of these. I don't know if you saw one of my latest videos of, about Taobao that they just forgot and I had to ask for a refund. So I decided to get five more pairs. To me, this is the cutest hangers I ever had and I'm just so happy to be able to finally put my clothing in some cute hangers. The other thing that I ordered is this cute um strawberry top so you might be wondering if i'm going to start dressing up pastel and um, the answer is i don't think so because i still like it i just want to experiment and see if i can wear other type of clothing with mori and mix it up a little bit or just go full mori i just want to uh feel comfortable and look cute too it fits me perfectly it's a little bit just a little bit um, uncomfortable on the back, but it's just a little bit This part over here the fabric of this blouse is very weird because it feels like a bathroom uh, curtain which is Again weird, but other than that the pattern of this top looks very very cute So I just wondering can I make this Mori? <laughs> I mean an alternative style of Mori because Mori doesn't uh, use this fabric or this pattern but yeah I think I can make it work I can make a, a cute strawberry Mori girl I don't know if you can tell but it has hard buttons and here is a close-up of the design of the pattern as you can see and here this was the non Mori girl top now let's continue another thing that may not be considered a uh, Mori it's this dress. I wanted this dress so bad and you will not believe that it's actually a little bit big on me. This is the first time that I ever bought something from Taobao that feels quite big on me but I don't care because I love it. It was inside one of the Mori stores so yeah let me show you. So it's this beautiful beautiful skirt with straps and just by looking at it it looks quite big this was the biggest size and as you can see it stretches at least on the back a lot it's just so so nice the fabric of this is like tapestry the only thing that I don't like about this besides 
being a little bit too big on me is that it doesn't have any pockets which is such such a bummer because it has enough fabric to have pockets so yeah and it's quite heavy i don't know if you notice but on the bottom it has some laces maybe that's why it was on a mori store because the model who was wearing this was also wearing uh, in other pictures mori clothing so, so maybe this is a little bit mori i don't even need the zipper <laughs> this is what we have it looks like a princess dress i just like it so much as you can see it looks quite big on here The next thing is this blouse, which many of you already saw on my Instagram picture. One of them was this blouse. I didn't notice later that I even got this in white, even though I bought it from another store. It's so, so comfortable, like very, very comfortable. And as you can see, it has a lot of ruffles over here. So this is how the blouse looks. As my coworker said, it looks like those medieval uh, kind of tops like peasants kind of kind of looking uh, clothing which I like I love medieval um, fairy tales and everything like that I like it because even though it looks simple it makes you look like you came out of like a fairy tale or something like that I really love the ruffles on the arms surprisingly it fits me perfect so I just tried out the top with the dress just, just for fun, just to see how it was gonna look. And honestly, it's not terrible. Maybe in another color, some hair accessories, and obviously the shoes, because I'm in my slippers. I don't know, it just looks so princess mixed up with peasant. <laughs> Classic, nice, cute. It's not pink, but to me, anyone can look so cute with this clothing. So I'm really, really happy with this. This is one of the other tops that I got. I think this is the one that is exactly like the green one. Um, as you can see, it's a little bit um, transparent because you can see my dress. This one is also very comfortable. Also, I forgot to mention that none of these tops are stretchable. Um, so yeah, you have no chance if they don't fit you. It has ruffles on the neck and ruffles over here. And this is how the arm looks like. Another thing that I like about this fashion is that I can mix it up with some Lolita clothing. That's something that I also want to try. I want to try Lolita. I can wear it with any overall dress and it will look great with these tops. Another thing is a pair of pants which I was really scared to get because I had no idea if it was going to fit me. Thankfully, it did. I don't know if I should say it perfectly, but it fits. They are like this. They are stretchable. I just love them because they have a lot of laces. This is what I just love about Mori. It's the layer thing, the layers concept. I just love it because there's so many possibilities. There's so many skirts, there's so many pants or leggings that you can just mix and match. And I just love that so much. And always create something. You don't necessarily have to buy this from Taobao. You can go to any thrift store. I decided to get them from Taobao because I had the money and I just decided to get them there. But you can just get... Uh, similar stuff on any tree store pants like this i'm not sure but blouses like this you see them everywhere so right now i'm wearing the pants with my dress uh, the dress is very thin so it doesn't feel like i have a a lot of fabric inside my pants but yeah this is just how it looks i'm just gonna let you know that i have like two or three more boxes with moddy clothing so yeah i have been making quite some purchase <laughs> the pants look so cute as you can see the pants are already creating a layer for your dress or your long t-shirt it looks like already you have already two layers over here and more layers on your on your legs you can wear a long dress and have this showing and um, yeah, I just layers, layers, layers. I just like it a lot. I feel like the pants are okay. They are a little, a little bit tight, but it's not like I'm dying. I have tried on like pants that are really killing me, and these, these are nothing, you know. 
Is it just how it looks? I'm so happy. So I got another top, kind of like pinkish, brownish, earthy looking top. It is a very oversized looking top. But I really like it. I don't know if you can appreciate um, the bottoms. They are wood and the patterns that I have on the top. There are a lot of flowers and it looks so, so cute. It's everywhere on the blouse, even on the back. And I really, really, really like um, how it looks. Again, it really looks nice with these pants. It creates another layer. I just need the cute shoes, some hair accessories, maybe a cardigan, uh, a lace cardigan, and I'm ready to go on, maybe a necklace. This could be such a cute outfit. And it looks like I have a bunch of stuff on, but it's just this top, the pants, and the dress. It looks like I'm very overdressed, but honestly, this feels so comfortable. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm so, so excited and so happy to start wearing this to my work. Um, honestly everywhere so talking about hair accessories I made a mix and match like I said previously and I got a headband that it was from a Lolita store the headband had laces and it's beige so this is the headband and it's so so beautiful like I really love it you can see it's all laces to me honestly this pass has Mori except for this because this is another fabric uh, Mori is more about like natural fabrics. Something that I love about this headband is that the fabric is removable so you can wash this. To me, that's awesome. This is the headband that I've been wearing on my Instagram pictures. I ordered more, but they're in the other box. Again, it wasn't a Lolita store, but this, this is Mori, you know, this is Mori. <laughs> It's so, so cute. It matches perfectly. It looks so freaking cute. The thing that I love about this fashion is that it is about enhancing, dressing natural, um, putting very light makeup to no makeup at all, just being natural. And yeah, I just love that a lot. I feel like this makes me feel more special. Um, I don't know about you guys. I feel kind of awkward, but I'm just so happy. The first shoes that I got for this haul are these amazing um, flower shoes which are a little bit big on me but I'm gonna put some insoles um, because they are my size, they are 39 which is 8 With Chinese shoes I always order 39 because I don't know, it always works like 38 I remember that my feet will be kind of uncomfortable so yeah I always go with 39 because these shoes are a little bit more wider but as you can see it's very very cool this is super muddy looking the best part of this is that they are velcro so these are the most comfortable easier shoes ever and as you can see they bend so they are not exactly like super hard rock shoes I push my foot the best I could and I have that space but I also have enough room to move over here so I feel like these are my perfect um, size. So this is just a demonstration of how a Mori girl looks like. As you can see, she has her cute kind of favorite looking shoes. Um, and I also have the pants, the blouse, the hair accessory. Again, I'm missing the jacket, but that's okay. This is just an idea for someone who uh, were wondering uh, how will I look like as a Mori. Very airy, nothing sticking to the body, nothing like that. Very respirable, I guess, something like that. So I ordered another pair of shoes and they look like this. Um, these are very easy to find um, in here, but they're all lace looking shoes. They're flat shoes. And look at the bottle, it's just so cute. It even has strawberries, tomatoes and stuff like that. <laughs> and they're very, um, is that how you say it? They are all full laces and you can see they have cherries uh, on the inside. It even has a very good cushion. So I really, really like this. I got this because this is a very different style than the other shoes that I got. So this is size 39. As you can see, I feel like they look very well together. They're a little bit 
big on me. Maybe I need to wear some insoles or something, or maybe just the socks. This is how it would look like if I were wearing these shoes. I will probably will wear these shoes with dresses. This is what I wanted to do. Like I wanted to wear a top like this, and then use like vest or you know cardigans and stuff like that. This is one of the ones I got. It just looks like that. The sleeves are so cute because you can adjust them. It all depends on how hot it is in here because I don't know if many of you know that I live in Florida so this is like insanity. I don't care anything for fashion. <laughs> I honestly like it even though I'm gonna die of a heat stroke. So this piece that I'm gonna show you is an under layer um, piece. I'm supposed to have a skirt under everything. It has laces and on here it's um, sheer, you can see everything, so I kind of wear this by itself. Um, the top is very plain, but it's very, very comfortable. Part over here is very stretchy. It's very, very cute. So this is how this underlayer dress looks like on me. Um, again, I'm still wearing the pants. You can see it does make a huge difference. It makes it look like more puffy. But it's still not complete because this part here looks very plain. This is again the top that I had earlier above of the dress on top of the pants layers. This is getting insane over right here. Just for the sake of curiosity, I'm just also gonna wear this. This is why I need a uh, no sleep version because it's just so hard to pass it through here. Oh my gosh, I like it. This fashion is not about overdoing, it's about as much as layer as possible, you know, look like you came out of the woods or of the forest. And I really like this. I have one more top and we're done. <laughs> this is the last piece, which is a white top. Um, this one again has a lot of cute um, designs and ruffles again. This is all around the blouse, which I really, really like. So this is how the top looks on me. This one is a little bit tight on the arm, more like a lolita dress. It fits me perfectly, like you can see it right here. And I really, really like it. Again, this doesn't go with all the stuff that I have of Modi because most of them are like beige. As you can see, it has a lot of ruffles over here and over the arms. And laces over here. Again, it's very, very comfortable. It's a little bit see-through, but it's okay. This is how this will look if I were wearing a white top with this dress. So guys, what do you think about this haul? Again, I know that it was very, very different, but I've been wanting to try this fashion for so, so, so long. So I'm very happy that I already did it. I'm so excited to finally get my other items so I can mix and match more with the stuff that I already have from this haul. Don't forget to also hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more kawaii videos. For more about Mori Girl fashion videos, let me know in the comment below if you like this video. Let me know if you love Mori K fashion. Anything that you want to say, say it in the comment below. So thank you very much for watching guys and I hope to see you next time. Take care. Bye bye.